How to respond to her hitting on you. Picture this, gentlemen, you're out and about, minding your own business, when suddenly you realize that the gorgeous woman you've been admiring from afar is actually hitting on you. Your heart races, your palms start to sweat, and your mind goes blank. What do you do? Well, fear not, because today I'm going to arm you with the tools you need to not only keep your cool in these critical moments but also to turn that initial spark of attraction into a full-blown inferno of connection and chemistry. By the end of this video, you'll be equipped with the skills to make the most of every flirtatious encounter and build the kind of connection that lasts. Before we unpack today's topic, if you feel like your dating life could use some expert advice, book a free strategy call by clicking the link in the description or pinned comment. Now, let's dive in. 1. Flirt back playfully. When a woman is hitting on you, one of the most effective ways to keep the spark alive is to engage in some playful flirting of your own. This doesn't mean you need to bust out your best pickup lines or cheesy one-liners. Instead, focus on keeping the conversation light, fun, and a little bit flirty. If she makes a joke, laugh along and add your own witty comeback. If she gives you a playful compliment, return the favor with a smile and a wink. The key here is to match her energy and show her that you're not afraid to let your guard down and have a good time. But be careful not to overdo it, you don't want to come on too strong or make her uncomfortable. Keep your flirting subtle, respectful, and always focused on making her feel good. If you can strike that balance, you'll be well on your way to building the kind of flirtatious rapport that can lead to something more. 2. Mirror her body language. When it comes to building a connection with someone, Sometimes it's the things we don't say that make the biggest impact. One powerful way to create a sense of rapport and attraction is to subtly mirror the other person's body language. If she leans in close while she's talking to you, lean in a little closer yourself. If she touches your arm or shoulder, find a natural way to reciprocate that physical contact. By subtly mimicking her gestures and posture, you'll be sending a subconscious signal that you're in sync with her and that you're both on the same wavelength. But again, the key word here is subtle. You don't want to be so obvious that it comes across as creepy or forced. Instead, focus on the little things, the tilt of your head, the angle of your body, the rhythm of your speech. By gradually aligning yourself with her physical presence, you'll create a sense of intimacy and connection that goes beyond words. And as always, make sure you're respecting her boundaries and reading her cues. If she seems uncomfortable or pulls away, take that as a sign to back off and give her some space. 3. Show confidence. Gentlemen, let's face it, confidence is sexy. When a woman is hitting on you, one of the most attractive things you can do is to respond with self-assurance and poise. This doesn't mean you need to be cocky or arrogant, but rather that you're comfortable in your own skin and secure in who you are. So, when she pays you a compliment, don't brush it off or downplay it. Accept it graciously and return the favor with a genuine compliment of your own. When she asks you a question, answer it honestly and directly, without hemming and hawing or second-guessing yourself. Remember, confidence isn't about being perfect or having all the answers, it's about being authentic, owning your strengths and weaknesses, and being unafraid to go after what you want. So, stand tall, make eye contact, and speak with conviction. Show her that you're a man who knows his worth and isn't afraid to pursue a genuine connection. That kind of quiet confidence is incredibly attractive and will go a long way in building her interest and desire. 4. Show interest in her life. When a woman is hitting on you, it's easy to get caught up in the excitement of the moment and forget to actually get to know her as a person. But if you want to build a real connection that goes beyond just flirting, it's important to show a genuine interest in her life and her passions. Ask her about her hobbies, her career, her dreams for the future. Listen attentively when she speaks, and ask follow-up questions to show that you're engaged and curious. Share your own experiences and perspectives, but always make sure to keep the focus on her and what she has to say. By showing a sincere desire to understand and appreciate her as an individual, you'll be laying the groundwork for a deeper, more meaningful connection. You'll be demonstrating that you value her thoughts and opinions and that you're interested in more than just a superficial fling. And who knows? You might just discover that you have more in common than you realized, paving the way for a truly special relationship to blossom. 5. Share something about yourself. Of course, building a connection isn't just about learning about the other person, it's also about sharing a bit of yourself in return. When a woman is hitting on you, she's not just interested in your charming smile or witty banter, she's interested in you as a whole person. 
So don't be afraid to open up and share something meaningful about yourself. Talk about your passions, your goals, your fears, and dreams. Give her a glimpse into what makes you tick and what drives you to be the best version of yourself. But be careful not to monopolize the conversation or turn it into a one-sided monologue. The key is to find a balance between sharing and listening, between revealing and discovering. And remember, vulnerability is a strength, not a weakness. By being open and honest about who you are and what you want, you'll be demonstrating a level of authenticity and emotional maturity that is incredibly attractive to women. So don't be afraid to let your guard down a little and show her the real you. It might just be the key to unlocking a deeper, more authentic connection. 6. Compliment her personality. When it comes to compliments, it's easy to default to the obvious, telling a woman she's beautiful or that you love her outfit. And while there's certainly nothing wrong with appreciating someone's physical appearance, if you want to really make an impact, try complimenting something a bit deeper. Focus on the qualities that make her unique and special as a person. Maybe it's her quick wit and sharp sense of humor, or the way she lights up when she talks about her favorite hobby. Maybe it's her compassion and kindness, or the way she always seems to know just the right thing to say. By highlighting the aspects of her personality that you admire and respect, you'll be showing her that you see and appreciate her for who she truly is. You'll be demonstrating that your interest goes beyond just the superficial and that you're drawn to the core of who she is as a human being. And in a world where so many interactions can feel shallow and transactional, that kind of genuine appreciation is a rare and precious gift. 7. Suggest future plans. As the conversation starts to wind down and the initial excitement of the flirtation begins to settle, it's important to keep the momentum going by planting the seeds for future interaction. One great way to do this is to casually suggest an activity or plan that you could do together down the line. Maybe there's a new restaurant in town that you've been dying to try, or a movie coming out that you think she'd love. Maybe you share a mutual hobby or interest that you could explore together, like hiking or checking out a local art exhibit. The key is to keep it casual and low pressure. You're not asking her out on a formal date or making any grand declarations of intent. You're simply extending an invitation to continue the connection and see where things might lead. By suggesting future plans, you'll be showing her that you're interested in more than just a fleeting moment of flirtation. You'll be demonstrating that you see potential for something more meaningful and lasting, and that you're willing to put in the effort to make it happen. And who knows? That casual suggestion might just be the start of a beautiful journey together. 8. End on a high note. As the old saying goes, always leave them wanting more. When it comes to flirting and building a connection, this couldn't be more true. So as your interaction starts to come to a close, make sure to end things on a positive, upbeat note. Maybe you have to head out to meet up with friends, or maybe she has to get back to work. Whatever the case may be, make sure to express how much you enjoyed talking to her and how much you appreciate the connection you've made. You might even throw in a playful tease or a flirtatious joke to keep the sparks flying until you meet again. The key is to leave her with a smile on her face and a flutter in her heart, eager to see you again and pick up right where you left off. By ending on a high note, you'll be cementing the positive impression you've made and ensuring that your connection remains strong even as you part ways for the time being. So, now that you know how to handle that situation, what's next for you? Discover the signs she hopes you find her attractive or learn how to tell if she's undressing you with her eyes. If you've made it this far my love, comment below with the word, 100%, or something else to let me know, to confirm that you've received the knowledge from the video so far. For more interesting topics, subscribe to the channel, leave a like on the video and share it later. Let's continue. Why smart men are more attractive, what women really want. You won't believe this. Everything you've been taught about attracting women is dead wrong. Forget the six-pack abs, the flashy car, and the cheesy pickup lines. The real key to unlocking a woman's heart and igniting her desire is something that's been right under your nose this whole time, intelligence. That's right, gentlemen, the smart guys have been hiding in plain sight, quietly seducing women with their razor-sharp wit and mind-blowing knowledge. In this video, we're going to expose their secrets and show you how to tap into the raw, primal power of intelligence to make any woman weak in the knees. So strap in because we're about to take a wild ride into the hidden world of attraction and uncover the shocking truth about what women really want. If you're new here, please press that red button to subscribe to the channel and comment, I've subscribed, so I can thank you. 1. Intellectual Conversations Have you ever found yourself completely captivated by a conversation with someone? 
Not just small talk about the weather or last night's game, but a deep, meaningful exchange of ideas that leaves you feeling energized and inspired. If so, you've experienced the power of an intellectual conversation. Let me tell you, it's not just mentally stimulating, it can be downright sexy. Women are drawn to men who can engage them on a deeper level. They want someone who can challenge their assumptions, broaden their perspectives, and make them think in new and exciting ways. A man who can hold his own in a conversation about politics, philosophy, or art is a man who exudes confidence, curiosity, and depth. But it's not just about showing off your knowledge or trying to impress her with your big brain. It's about genuinely connecting with her mind and showing that you value her thoughts and opinions. When you can have a conversation that flows easily from one topic to the next, bouncing ideas off each other and building on each other's insights, it creates a sense of intimacy and connection that's hard to resist. So the next time you find yourself in a conversation with a woman you're interested in, don't be afraid to dive deep. Ask her about her passions, her dreams, and her ideas about the world. Show her that you're not just interested in her body, but in her mind as well. Trust me, she'll find it irresistible. 2. Problem-Solving Skills Picture this, you're out on a date with a woman you really like. Suddenly, you're faced with a challenge, maybe the restaurant lost your reservation, or your car won't start. How do you handle it? If you're a man with strong problem-solving skills, you don't panic. You stay calm, assess the situation, and come up with a plan. You might call around to find another restaurant with availability or troubleshoot the car issue until you figure out a solution. All the while, your date is watching, taking note of how you handle adversity. Women are attracted to men who can think on their feet and find creative solutions to problems. It shows that you're resourceful, adaptable, and able to handle whatever life throws your way. In a world full of challenges and uncertainties, that's an incredibly valuable quality. But it's not just about being a hero in a crisis. Problem-solving skills come in handy in all sorts of situations, from planning a trip to navigating a tricky work project. When you can approach problems with a clear head and a can-do attitude, it inspires confidence and trust in those around you. So the next time you're faced with a challenge, embrace it as an opportunity to show off your problem-solving prowess. Your date will be impressed, and maybe even a little turned on by your ability to handle whatever comes your way. 3. Intelligence signals good genes. Alright folks, let's talk about the elephant in the room, the link between intelligence and genetic fitness. Now, before you start worrying about your 23andMe results, hear me out. From an evolutionary perspective, intelligence is a highly desirable trait in a mate. It suggests that a person has good problem-solving skills, is able to adapt to new situations, and can potentially pass on those valuable genes to their offspring. In other words, when a woman is attracted to a man's intelligence, she's not just thinking about stimulating conversation over dinner, she's thinking about the future, specifically the genetic future of her potential children. Now, I know what you might be thinking, but I'm not looking to have kids anytime soon. And that's totally valid. But the thing is, our attraction to certain traits is often subconscious and rooted in our evolutionary past. We can't help but be drawn to qualities that signal genetic fitness, even if we're not consciously thinking about reproducing. But here's the good news, you don't have to be a genius to signal genetic fitness. Simply demonstrating that you're curious, adaptable, and able to learn new things can be enough to catch a woman's eye. So don't be afraid to show off your love of learning, whether it's by taking a cooking class or reading up on a new subject that fascinates you. At the end of the day, intelligence is about more than just IQ points, it's about showing that you're a capable, curious, and adaptable person, and that's sexy as hell. 4. Humor and Wit Have you ever been in a room where one person seems to have everyone in stitches? They're cracking jokes, making clever observations, and generally lighting up the place with their wit and charm. Chances are that person is intelligent and also highly attractive to the people around them. Humor and wit are often seen as signs of intelligence, and for good reason. It takes a quick mind and a sharp tongue to come up with a clever joke or a witty comeback on the fly. When someone can make us laugh, it creates a sense of connection and intimacy that's hard to resist. But it's not just about being funny. Humor and wit also suggest that a person is confident, socially adept, and able to think outside the box. They're not afraid to take risks or poke fun at themselves, and they have a way of putting others at ease with their easy charm. So if you want to up your attraction game, don't be afraid to let your inner comedian shine. Work on your delivery, your timing, and your ability to read a room. 
And remember, the best humor comes from a place of authenticity and self-awareness, so don't try to force it if it doesn't feel natural. At the end of the day, a man who can make a woman laugh is a man who's already halfway to her heart. 5. Stability and Security Let's face it, folks, the world can be a scary and unpredictable place. We all crave a sense of stability and security in our lives, whether it's in our careers, our finances, or our relationships. When it comes to attraction, women are often drawn to men who can provide that sense of stability and security. But what does that have to do with intelligence, you might ask? Well, think about it, a man who's intelligent and successful in his career is likely to be more financially stable and better able to provide for a family. He's also more likely to be emotionally mature and able to weather the ups and downs of life with grace and resilience. In other words, intelligence is often seen as a marker of stability and security. It suggests that a man has his act together, knows what he wants, and has the tools and resources to make it happen. But it's not just about material success. A man who's intelligent and emotionally mature is also more likely to be a good communicator, a supportive partner, and a reliable teammate in life's adventures. He's someone who can be trusted to show up, follow through, and be there when it counts. So if you want to attract a woman who's looking for stability and security, focus on cultivating your own sense of groundedness and emotional intelligence. Show her that you're someone she can count on, both in good times and bad. And remember, true stability comes from within, so work on building a strong foundation of self-awareness, self-respect, and inner peace. 6. Better Decision Making Alright guys, let's talk about one of the sexiest qualities a man can have, good decision-making skills. Now, I know what you're thinking, how can something as boring as decision-making be a turn-on? But hear me out. When a man is able to make smart, thoughtful decisions, it shows that he's in control of his life and his future. He's not just drifting along, letting life happen to him, he's actively shaping his own destiny. And that's incredibly attractive to women. A man who can weigh the pros and cons, think through the consequences of his actions, and make a decision that aligns with his values and goals, that's a man who's going places. But it's not just about making big, life-altering decisions. Even small, everyday choices can be a chance to show off your decision-making prowess. Like when you're out on a date and you're trying to decide what to order. Do you hem and haw and let your date take the lead, or do you confidently make a choice based on your own preferences and dietary needs? Or when you're faced with a tricky situation at work. Do you avoid the problem and hope it goes away, or do you tackle it head-on with a clear plan of action? The way you approach decisions, big and small, says a lot about your character and your intelligence. So don't be afraid to show off your decision-making skills in front of your crush. She'll be impressed by your confidence, your thoughtfulness, and your ability to take charge when it counts. 7. Life Success Let's be real, success is sexy. And I'm not just talking about having a fat bank account or a corner office, although those things certainly don't hurt. I'm talking about the kind of success that comes from living a life that's authentic, fulfilling, and true to your values. And guess what? Intelligence is often a key factor in achieving that kind of success. Think about it, the most successful people in the world, whether they're entrepreneurs, artists, or activists, are often the ones who are able to think creatively, solve complex problems, and communicate their ideas effectively. They are the ones who are always learning, growing, and pushing themselves to be better. And that's incredibly attractive to women. A man who's passionate about his work, who's constantly striving to improve himself and make a difference in the world, that's a man who's going to inspire and motivate the people around him. But it's not just about professional success. Intelligence also plays a key role in personal growth and self-awareness. A man who's emotionally intelligent, who's able to reflect on his own thoughts and feelings and communicate them clearly to others, that's a man who's going to be a great partner, a supportive friend, and an all-around awesome human being. So if you want to up your attraction game, focus on cultivating your own sense of success and fulfillment. Pursue your passions, challenge yourself to grow and learn, and be the best version of yourself you can be. Trust me, the ladies will take notice. 8. Goal-Oriented Alright guys, we've covered a lot of ground today, but there's one last quality I want to touch on before we wrap things up, and that's the power of being goal-oriented. Women are often attracted to men who know what they want and are willing to go after it with everything they've got. And that's where intelligence comes in. A man who's intelligent and goal-oriented is a man who's able to think strategically, plan for the future, and take action to make his dreams a reality. 
He's not just sitting around waiting for life to happen to him, he's out there making things happen for himself. And that's incredibly sexy. A man who's driven, ambitious, and willing to put in the work to achieve his goals, that's a man who's going to be successful in all areas of his life, from his career to his relationships. But it's not just about having big, lofty goals. Even small, everyday goals can be a chance to show off your goal-oriented nature. Like when you set a goal to read a certain number of books in a month or to learn a new skill in your free time. It shows that you're always striving to better yourself and grow as a person. And when you're able to share your goals and dreams with a woman, it creates a sense of intimacy and connection. She'll be inspired by your passion and your drive, and she'll want to be a part of your journey. So don't be afraid to set big goals for yourself, both in your personal and professional life. And don't be afraid to share those goals with the women in your life. They'll be attracted to your intelligence, your ambition, and your willingness to go after what you want. So now that you know why intelligence is so sexy, what's next for you? Discover the clear signs someone likes you a lot or learn the phrases that instantly increase sexual tension. If you've made it this far my love, comment below with the word 200% or something else to let me know, to confirm that you've received the knowledge from the video so far. For more interesting topics, subscribe to the channel, leave a like on the video and share it later. Let's continue. Are you oblivious to her seduction signals? Unspoken attraction. Picture this, gentlemen, you're out there in the wild world of dating, trying to navigate the complex dance of attraction. You're looking for those telltale signs that she's into you, but sometimes it feels like you're searching for a needle in a haystack. But what if I told you that you might be overlooking some of the most powerful signals of interest? That's right, there's a whole world of subtle flirtation happening right under your nose, and you might be missing it entirely. In this video, we're going to explore 8 of the most commonly missed signs of attraction. These are the little things she does when she's trying to catch your eye and capture your heart, the secret code of body language, conversation, and connection. But here's the thing, spotting these signals isn't always easy. They're often disguised as something else entirely, and it takes a keen eye and a bit of practice to read between the lines. So if you're ready to become a master of the unspoken language of attraction, keep watching. By the end of this video, you'll be able to spot these signs from a mile away and use them to your advantage in the game of love. Before we get rolling, for those of you looking to rethink your dating approach, why not take advantage of a free strategy call? Find the link in the description or pinned comment. 1. Engaging in light competition. Has a woman ever challenged you to a friendly game of pool, dared you to beat her high score on a video game, or playfully trash-talked you during a round of mini-golf? If so, you might have been on the receiving end of a powerful flirtation technique, light competition. When a woman engages you in these kinds of playful contests, it's often a sign that she's trying to establish a connection and build rapport. By challenging you to a friendly competition, she's creating a shared experience and a sense of camaraderie, even if she's technically trying to beat you. But the real magic of this technique lies in the way it showcases her own skills and abilities. When she sinks that impossible shot or racks up an impressive score, she's not just having fun, she's showing you what she's made of. It's a subtle way of saying, hey, I'm pretty amazing. Are you up for the challenge? So the next time a woman tries to engage you in a bit of light competition, don't just brush it off as silly fun. Take it as a sign that she's trying to catch your eye and make a lasting impression. 2. Sitting cross-legged towards you. Gentlemen, when it comes to body language, sometimes the smallest gestures can speak the loudest. One of the most powerful signals of interest a woman can send your way is the way she sits when she's talking to you. Specifically, pay attention to the direction of her crossed legs. If she's sitting with her legs crossed towards you, it's a strong indication that she's fully engaged in the conversation and focused on you. You see, our bodies have a way of betraying our true feelings and intentions. When we're interested in someone, we tend to orient ourselves towards them, and that includes the way we position our legs. By crossing her legs in your direction, she's sending a subconscious signal that she's tuned into you and wants to give you her full attention. Of course, this isn't a foolproof sign on its own, some people simply have a habit of sitting cross-legged regardless of who they're talking to. But if you notice her consistently orienting her body towards you, especially in combination with other signs of interest, it's a pretty strong indication that she's into you. 3. Highlighting Similarities have you ever been deep in conversation with a woman, only to have her excitedly point out all the things you have in common? Maybe she's thrilled to discover that you both love the same obscure band or that you share a passion for a particular hobby or sport. 
If so, you might have been on the receiving end of a classic flirtation technique, highlighting similarities. When a woman goes out of her way to emphasize the things you have in common, it's often a sign that she's trying to create a sense of connection and compatibility. We tend to be drawn to people who share our interests, values, and experiences. It's a fundamental aspect of human attraction, we want to be with people who get us and understand where we're coming from. So when a woman starts pointing out all the ways in which you're similar, she's essentially saying, hey, we're on the same wavelength. We have a special connection. Of course, this technique can also be used in platonic friendships, but if you notice a woman consistently going out of her way to highlight your similarities, especially in a flirtatious or romantic context, it's a pretty strong sign that she's into you. 4. Sudden interest in your opinions. Gentlemen, have you ever been chatting with a woman when suddenly she starts asking for your opinion on everything from your favorite movies to your political views? If so, you might have stumbled upon a powerful sign of attraction, sudden interest in your opinions. When we're attracted to someone, we tend to value their thoughts and perspectives more than we would with a casual acquaintance. We want to know what makes them tick, what they believe in, and how they see the world. So when a woman starts seeking out your opinion on a wide range of topics, it's often a sign that she's trying to get to know you on a deeper level. She's not just making small talk, she's genuinely interested in understanding your mind and your worldview. But here's the thing, this technique is often used as a way of seeking approval and validation. By asking for your opinion, she's essentially saying, I value what you think, and I want to make sure we're on the same page. So if you notice a woman suddenly showing a keen interest in your opinions and perspectives, take it as a sign that she's trying to build a deeper connection and gauge your compatibility. It's a powerful indicator that she's into you and wants to take things to the next level. If you're enjoying the content and looking to transform your dating life, don't just watch, act. Our free strategy call offers personalized tips on meeting more women and dating with confidence. Find out more by clicking the link in the pinned comment. 5. Showing interest in your schedule. Alright guys, let's talk about another subtle sign of attraction that often goes unnoticed, showing interest in your schedule and daily routine. When a woman starts asking about your plans for the weekend, your work schedule, or your daily habits, it's often a sign that she's trying to find ways to spend more time with you. She's looking for opportunities to insert herself into your life and create shared experiences. But it's not just about logistics. By showing an interest in your schedule, she's also demonstrating that she cares about your life and wants to be a part of it. She's curious about how you spend your time and what matters to you, and that's a powerful indicator of attraction. Of course, this technique can also be used in platonic friendships, but if you notice a woman consistently asking about your plans and routines, especially in a flirtatious or romantic context, it's a pretty strong sign that she's into you. So the next time a woman starts showing a keen interest in your daily life, don't just brush it off as idle curiosity. Take it as a sign that she's trying to create a deeper connection and find ways to be a part of your world. 6. Complimenting your skills. Gentlemen, let's be real, who doesn't love a good compliment? But when it comes to flirtation, not all compliments are created equal. One of the most powerful types of praise a woman can give you is complimenting your skills and abilities. Think about it, when a woman admires your talent for playing guitar, your knack for cooking the perfect steak, or your impressive knowledge of world history, she's not just stroking your ego, she's demonstrating that she sees you as a capable, competent person with valuable skills and expertise. And that, my friends, is incredibly attractive. We're naturally drawn to people who excel at the things they do, and when a woman takes notice of your unique talents and abilities, it's a sign that she's paying close attention and likes what she sees. But here's the thing, complimenting your skills is also a way of building trust and admiration. By acknowledging your strengths and abilities, she's essentially saying, I respect and value what you bring to the table. I trust in your capabilities and expertise. So if you notice a woman consistently complimenting your skills and talents, take it as a powerful sign of attraction. She's not just impressed by what you can do, she's attracted to the very essence of who you are. 7. Sharing secrets. Let's dive into one of the most intimate and revealing signs of attraction, sharing secrets. When a woman starts opening up to you about her deepest fears, her most cherished dreams, or her most vulnerable moments, it's a sign that she trusts you on a profound level. She's not just making idle chit-chat, she's inviting you into her inner world and sharing a part of herself that she doesn't reveal to just anyone. And that, my friends, is a huge deal. We only share our secrets with the people we trust and feel a deep connection with. 
By revealing her innermost thoughts and feelings to you, she's essentially saying, I feel safe with you. I trust you with my heart and my vulnerabilities. But sharing secrets isn't just about building trust, it's also about creating intimacy. When two people share their deepest, most private thoughts and experiences, it creates a bond that goes beyond the superficial. It's a way of saying, I see you, and I want you to see me too. So if a woman starts sharing her secrets with you, don't take it lightly. It's a powerful sign that she's into you and wants to create a deep, meaningful connection that goes beyond the surface level. 8. Sharing Personal Achievements Finally, let's talk about one of the most overlooked signs of attraction, sharing personal achievements and accomplishments. When a woman starts telling you about her latest promotion at work, her impressive athletic feats, or her academic successes, it's easy to assume that she's just bragging or seeking validation. But in reality, it's often a sign that she's trying to impress you and demonstrate her value as a potential partner. We're naturally attracted to people who are successful, driven, and accomplished. It's a sign of competence, ambition, and value, all qualities that are highly desirable in a romantic partner. So when a woman starts sharing her achievements with you, it's often a way of saying, hey, I'm a catch. I have a lot to offer, and I want you to see me as someone who's worthy of your time and attention. But it's not just about impressing you, it's also about creating a sense of shared success and accomplishment. By inviting you to celebrate her victories and milestones, she's creating a bond and a sense of partnership. It's a way of saying, I want you to be a part of my journey and share in my successes. So if a woman starts sharing her personal achievements with you, take it as a sign that she's into you and wants to create a connection based on shared values and mutual admiration. So now that you know how to spot those seduction signals, what's next for you? Discover the signs she's trying to see if you're interested in her, or learn how to read her body language when she's checking you out. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more.